How much is it? That genuine shared beaver sells for $1,100. Oh, well. <laughs> Thank you very much. Goodbye. <laughs> but may I remind you, madam, that this is our January sale and everything in stock is 30% off. Which means? Which means this coat has been marked down to only $725. You you don't my 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 you don't my Bob kill I'd admit oh. I'd never. <laughs> uh, no, it's, too, it's, too, it's too much I couldn't. He loved me with it, Madame. Madame, why don't you take it home on trial? And if for any reason you're not satisfied, bring it back. Yes, madam. Put it on me and let me... Of course. Put it on. I'll, 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 I'll try it. Uh, oh, thank you very much. You are um, just charming. Thank you so much. Thank you, madam. Come on, girls. Uh, madam, madam, if you please, madam. Anything I can do for you, sir? Yes. Who are you? <laughs> oh, of course. Your name, Excuse me, your I, name. Yes, I... Oh. Uh, let's see, I'm, um, oh, <laughs> I'm, I'm Mrs. Bob, I'm Mrs. Bob Victor. Mrs. Yes. Bob Victor. Uh, here, here's, my, here's my driver's license, yes. and here, here's my registration card, registration. and, and, and here, here's a picture of, of uh, no, that isn't it. No. Here, here's a picture of my, there, my, my husband and me, when, when we were first married, you see, he's yes. smiling there. Yes, he is. Uh, I don't know about later, though. <laughs> Smash the car. <laughs> it's just love. Sweetheart. My goodness, can't a married woman just kiss the man she's married to? That was no marriage kiss, dear. <laughs> that was a money kiss. <laughs> Sweetheart mine. No, darling. Oh, no, darling, no, sweetheart, sweetheart mine. No. What's the matter with kissing the most handsome, wonderful man? Is oh, let me put your shoes on. Oh, that was a three hundred dollar kiss. Oh yes. <laughs> now let me explain, darling. I have a wonderful dinner, all fixed for you. Just your favorite dinner, darling. We have roast beef. Come on over here. Let me help you to the table. Yes, dear. dear. Help me we to the table. We have roast beef. We have gravy, just the way you like it. You sweetheart. may have to help me away from the table. Yes. We have <laughs> And I made you a lemon meringue pie, sweetheart, just as high. A lemon meringue pie that high? Yes, darling. High lemon meringue pie. Yes, sweetheart. Now you sit right here, and I'll go get it for you. Okay. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't know. I was just getting ahead. Had a few bucks in the bank. <laughs> Along comes a lemon meringue pie. <laughs> I think if I can get away with about $200 for the dinner, I think I'm doing good. <laughs> $200 for the dinner, the kiss, and including the tip, I'll be all right. There you are, sweetheart. And I even cut it all up so you won't have to do a thing. Oh, there you are. Thank now, look, you. I'll even feed you, sweetheart. Here's your bone. <laughs> That's the way you like it. You're so sweet. 
around the bush either, darling. You can't have it. I got no money. No, no, no. no sorry, lady, got no money. No. I'm sorry, lady, got no money. Got no money, lady. No way. Get out of here. I tell you now, got no money, lady. I'm telling you now. I know. Calm down, darling. Calm down. I tell you now. I got no money. No, I don't want to explain. I got no money, lady. Lady, go away from me, please. Just let me say, just let me explain, sweetheart. All right? Say you let me explain. Explain. Yes, now look. Look, you buy me a birthday present every year, right? Yes. You buy me an anniversary present every year, right? Right. And a wedding present every year, right? Right? Right. Well, now look, for the next five years, you don't have to buy me a thing. You don't even have to come in with a blade of grass, sweetheart. And that's the way we can pay for the coat, because every year you spend at least two or three hundred dollars on presents. Who spends two or three hundred dollars on presents? You do. You told me so. That's what I tell you. I don't... <laughs> I got a guy who's a nice rapper. That's all. Well, that's well, well, look, I got no money, well, lady. Let me explain something. Look, whatever it is, whatever it costs, that's what we can say, sweetheart. And also, we won't take our trip to Bermuda, okay? Okay. Good. Okay. Fine. What trip to Bermuda? Who's going to Bermuda? Sweetheart, if we don't go to Bermuda, we'll save $500. Let's not go to Paris. We'll save $1,000. See how easy it is to buy the coat? Don't go to... Look, sweetheart, just sit down and let me explain it. I have it all worked out on this paper right here. Now, look, the coat costs $725. Well, now, the coat's going to last me at least 10 years. So over a period of 10 years, that's just 20 cents a day. All right, here's 20 cents. Catch me every morning for the next 10 years. You've got a coat. Oh, they got no money. Leave me alone. Bob, you've got the money. Sweetheart, we've 
got all that money in the bank. I, what do you mean, got money? We, we got, got $1,200. That's not our money that we owe. We owe. I owe for the house. I owe for the car. I owe. That's not our money. That's they money. That's they. <laughs> Sweetheart, we can manage. And you can't always just think of the, of the fundamental things that you have to pay for. You have to think of happiness. And what's more pleasurable to spend money on happiness? What is money? What is money? I'll show you what money. Here's money. Here, see money? And money talks, right? Here, listen to the money. No coke, ladies! <laughs> My money's happening. <laughs> it's in a bank. It's nice and comfortable. It's making friends with fives and tens, and that's the way I want to Now, let's, let's look at it from another point of view. Now, just calm down and sit down and listen to me. Just be reasonable and listen to me. I want to explain about the coach. Now, look, Bob, you want to be a success. I want you to be a success. But how do you be successful? You look successful. Now, if I have this fur coat, we'll be walking down the street and people will turn around and say, oh, look at that man. Look at the beautiful fur coat that man bought for his wife. My, that man must be a big success. And little will they know that that man that's walking with the woman in the fur coat has ripped underwear. That's <laughs> Where are you going? I'm going to take the coat back. Where are you going to go now? It's, it's dark. It's 7 o'clock at night. Because Where are you going to go? The store's open until 9 o'clock, and, and, and I don't want you to sit here and, and worry all night about the money that you've got in the bank. Good night, sport. <laughs> okay. I did the right thing. After all, sometimes you've got to hurt people to, to help them. Boy, I hope that tonight. <laughs> she must be somewhere. I'm going crazy. Where could she be? <coughs> That's her now. She's driving up trying to scare me. No, sir. I'll just sit here like I wasn't scared. Hello, darling. Thought you'd scare me? I'm not trying to scare you, sweetheart. <laughs> just want to talk to you. I couldn't talk, my wife was there. I can't impress on you too firmly how important it is for you not to buy your wife a fur coat. I can't afford it. Look, I told you before, I'm not buying her a fur coat. That's, I said she went out of here at 7 o'clock to bring one back. You understand? She's not back here yet. Oh. Where is she? I don't know. That's probably her now. Here. Yeah. She's here. Hello, honey. How are you? <laughs> Everybody's so nice to me tonight. That's what Alice did when I came home. Listen, Bob, what's going on here? I'm, you sounded so worried. Why, and what's this all about a beaver? Look, oh. man wants to buy a beaver coat. I sent her back with the coat. Oh. But I don't know. I, I just can't make it out. She left here at 7 o'clock, and it's 11 o'clock. Now I, I, I'm getting crazy. I'm, I'm telling you, I, I'm, it's the first time I've ever been in a house alone without her. You know what I mean? And I just, I, it's a funny feeling. I mean, it just proved that I must... I must really be pretty much madly in love with her, you know what I mean? If any of you guys ever say that to her, I'll to break your neck, you hear? Because if she finds out that I'm madly in love with her, she'll get drunk with power. That's all. Leave all that on. Oh, no, we wouldn't. We won't tell her. She just wanted a fur coat, and, and I yelled at her. <laughs> Never yell at her again. Where you been? I stay here going crazy. Why will you? I took the coat back, and then I was so mad, I, I went to a movie. You went to a movie, and I stay here like a crazy man? Good night, Bob. Good, good night. night. Good night. You want to say good night? Yeah, happy yeah. Yeah. Good night. Give my regards. You mean to tell me that you went there and stood there like a maniac while I'm staying here like a maniac? Why well, do you know I'm madly in love with you? What's the matter with you? I'm madly in love with you, and you don't even know it. Now I'm telling you right now, and you have don't care if I'm madly in love with you, because I know you get drunk with power and you want everything like a sink and everything like that. <laughs> now I'm telling you, that's all. I'm madly in love with you, and that's it. That's right. I'm going up there. Mother, I... I don't know what to do, though. I just don't know what to do. He stormed out of here this morning. He, he wouldn't eat his breakfast. He didn't even speak to me last night. He, he hollered at me. I, 
I should never even started this whole nonsense with the fur coat. I don't know what I'm going to do. I, I, I tried last night to fix him everything he liked, and I've got a nice dinner for him tonight. I'm just waiting for him to come home. I'm so nervous. I, I don't know what he's going to say, Mother. I just, I just don't know what... I think I hear him coming. I, I better hang up, Mother. I'll, I'll, I'll let you know what happened later. Goodbye, dear. Sweetheart, I... All right, you got it. Bob, I thank you very much, sweetheart, but I, I, I don't want the coat. What? <laughs> you don't want no coat? Don't you imagine me a crazy nut that I like you? I was giving a lot of thought. I spoke to Mother, and she told me what to do, and, and she's right. Look, sweetheart, I know a woman is out of her mind to turn down a fur coat, but, well, I... I had a picture of myself walking down the street with my two best friends, and, and, and there they'd be in their cloth coats, and there I'd be in a beautiful fur coat, and I just, I wouldn't feel right, sweetheart. I, I couldn't do it to them, and I thank you with all my heart, darling, but I just, I don't want the coat. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, honey, I'm, I'm real proud of you. No kidding. That's a real, real right way of looking at things, you know? And thank you, too, sweetheart. And thank you for the money back, darling. <laughs> you got it. You got it. Fever, oh, no. fever. No. Fever everywhere. Put mine on. Put mine on. Look at this. Oh, my goodness. I'm not for it. You, Bob, you opened up the floodgates. <laughs> well, what's the difference? They look nice in them, don't they? I tell you, I didn't know my wife was that pretty. <laughs> yeah. You know, it'll mean giving up a few things, like cigars, water. <laughs> well, come on, let's take a walk around the Jones house and show them we're keeping up with them. Come on. <laughs>